the night before Tobin Christmas, and all through the land, cars were piled high with scrumptious treats made carefully by hand. The Game Boys and laptops were bundled with care, and the GPS proclaimed, Two hours and fifteen minutes until you are there. Recalculating. You see, although our family tale has been told many years over, this year marks new tradition, starting with a Cape Cod road trip in your new Rogue or Range Rover. And with new traditions comes great opportunity to pass the torch to some of the newer adults in the community. For you may have not known it, Anne, but your lessons have surely been grand. And in the silence of the night, with not a critter in sight, your crawlers have developed a plan. To rekindle your Christmas spirit, with not pen and paper, but laptops at hand. So for Santa hats for everyone, for heads big and small, get ready to hear some Christmas memories we have of you all. For after much deliberation on what we could possibly share, we decided to share the lessons we have learned for making today's occasion so special and so rare. The first lesson, of course, is how to pick the perfect location, a decision made after much consultation. For a touch of whimsy is required in these types of halls, like having a resident elf on hand and wrapping the walls. Hey Dan. Hey Dan. You ready to tell these people about Tobin Family Christmas? <laughs> yeah, I sure am. All the food they're going to be enjoying? Mm-hmm. Well, there is food upon food upon food food. What a sight. But if you ask for my dad's chowder, well, you better say it right. Ch do I say chowder? No, it's chowder. Ch ch chowder? No, you're trying too hard. Chowder. Ch chowder. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, if you're not full after food and punch filled with fizz, well, then there's death by gym. I mean, come on. Let's call it what it is. Yeah, I think you're right there. I know I am. You know, last time I had it, I almost, like, had my stomach rupture. It was, it was bad. Yeah, uh, me too. So as Dan said, there are endless eats to munch. No Christmas is complete without the famous Tobin Punch. The taste and quality receive an A for a grade, but the true merit all lies in how it is made. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. Come on, let's go see what we have on the menu. Hi. Hello. Welcome to another edition of Chris and Luke's Good Eats and Drink. Today we're going to be making a special family favorite, Tobin Punch. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. It's real simple to make. It's great around the holidays. It only takes a few simple ingredients. Today we've got fruit punch, ginger ale, Rainbow sherbet, mmm, and ice. So let's go ahead and get started. All right, go ahead and add the first ingredient, Luke. First, we add the ginger ale. Punch, start with the punch. We got the punch. Uh, snap the cap open. We're just gonna add it right in there. We're just gonna jump right into this. See how it goes. Once you get the punch flowing, you're gonna wanna start putting some ginger ale right in there. And it's okay to do them both at once, that's fine. That's gonna make a nice mix. Solid. Look at that. That's good. Now that alone would be a delicious punch, but we don't stop there with the famous Tobin punch. Oh, no, no, no. We're gonna go ahead and add three scoops of sherbet, but before we do that, we're gonna stir the punch. No, 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 what are you doing, what are you doing? Counterclockwise, oh. counterclockwise, the other way. Yeah. The details are what make this punch great, okay? That's the most important part. So we're gonna go ahead and add the sherbet. There you go. I'll let Luke do that. What, you, you think you're done? Three, three scoops, three scoops. Three scoops of rainbow sherbet. Really important. You wanna be able to scoop right in there and get a little sherbet with the rest of your punch. It's delicious, it's delicious. Two, that's two. Great. Terrific. All right. We're going to go ahead and add the ice. A nice chill punch. Okay. Stir it one more time for good measure there, Luke. 
That's great. Just once. Then. Just once. One more stir. Sorry. It's okay. That's okay. All right. I think uh, I think we'll let it sit for a second, then we'll go ahead and try it. All right. So our punch looks like it's all set. It looks like it came out great. Let's go ahead and try it. Best part, am I right? Oh, yeah. All right. A little for the loop. Oh, thanks. And a little for myself. Okay. Um, cheers. Yeah. All right. So it usually doesn't come out this green. Uh, that's new. Uh, but if you follow the directions, you should come out with a delicious punch. Okay. Be the first kid in the line for food when the menu's laid out, stretching the whole kitchen wide. Ham, beans, mac and cheese, some vegan item you've never tried. Now when you hear the aunties call, okay kids, come and get it. Don't delay, drop your game, and we'll make a mad run for it. No need to throw elbows or get too upset, but you know, the faster we eat, the more desserts that we get. At times in this crowd, you'll have important things to say, but you'll find the adults are just gabbing away. Our suggestion is to take to Ottoman or chair. Be quiet. I do declare. Now the whole room is looking at you. Make sure to say something particularly cute, or just simply start dancing, or recite a long poem. Or sing them a song about turkeys running away from home. The next best bet is to put on a play, but you'll have to rehearse. Or you could pick up a guitar and strum out a verse. <laughs> And so, without further ado, we will end this poem with one last lesson for you. No matter the house, big or small, presents short or tall, what matters most of all, we here together, y'all. You go. I go. Happy Tobin Family Christmas. Have a great Tobin Family Christmas, everybody. Happy Tobin Family Christmas. Have a Merry Tobin Christmas party, everyone. Happy Tobin Family Christmas! Happy Tobin Family Christmas! Happy Tobin Family Christmas! <laughs> Good girl! Okay, guys, everyone ready to sing the song? Yeah, we're ready. Ready. Great. Now, remember, it's almost Christmas, and nobody has any pod safe Christmas music, so uh, that's your motivation here. Uh, CeCe Chapman, you ready? Ready as I'll ever be. And uh, Lennon Nora from Jawbone, good to go? Let's do this! And uh, Adam Curry, Skyping in from the helicopter flying somewhere above your golden palace, you all patched in there?